we are all in our youtube channel Lexis project and today we will see a new hardware setup title name is iot based water quality monitoring system and dissolved oxygen monitoring system okay so system is as available on your screen as you can see okay here is our entire setup and here are the sensors and here are the sample water samples okay you can see and here is the laptop to monitor all the data okay and here is the power supply okay So let's see each and every components one by one before the it's working. So here you can see it is a main switch to turn on and off the entire system. Okay. And next is a power supply input jack here. Okay. Uh, we can provide here 9 volt to or 8 volt for DC. Okay. For the system of power operation. And next is a pH sensor here. Okay. You can see here's a pH sensor. Okay. To measure the amount of pH available in the water. Next is a TDS sensor. Okay. To uh, measure the TDS amount uh, available in the water. Okay. And next is our large, large screen 16 cross 4 okay, to see all the parameters live here and here is the button to adjust LCD contrast. And next is a very important part uh, it is the brain of the system ESP32 okay, and it is responsible to take all the data okay, uh, from the sensors and display on the LCD and to send live on the server okay, to the laptop. Okay. And next is a very important uh, dissolved oxygen sensor okay, you can see. Okay. Uh, dissolved oxygen sensor to measure the amount of oxygen available in the water. Okay, next is a turbidity sensor here to check either the water is clear, clear or dirty. Okay, so here you can see the sensor. And next is a temperature sensor here to measure the temperature of the water. Okay. So after watching the components description, you can also remove all the components. Okay, so many components. Okay, you can see you can remove the LCD also. You can remove HP32. Okay, for the study or maintenance purpose, you can understand. Okay, and you can also remove this pH sensor okay, from this header. Okay, this sensor can also be removed using these characters. Okay, and this is a uh, 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 dissolved oxygen sensor can also be can also remove for the maintenance purpose. Okay, in this way. Okay. And also we can remove power supply from here. Okay. So dear student, as you can see, entire setup is ready here. Okay. Okay, each and everything is ready. So let's just turn on the setup using the main switch. So as you can see, project name is appearing on the screen. And then after some seconds, like five to seven seconds, we will see all the parameters on the screen. Later it is showing, okay. Now you can see all the parameters, pH is 7.4, okay, temperature 25 degrees, room temperature, TDC is, uh, 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 you can see turbidity is 100% because sensor is outside of the water okay and this is the dissolved oxygen uh, measurement this is the 13 million milligram only okay and pH 7.4 meter okay and remember uh, these glasses now uh, currently fresh water okay and we will need to add some samples for the testing purpose okay so we will add it uh, so let's add all the samples to the fresh water okay so here is the salt water glass you can see salt we are adding Okay, some amount of salt we are adding. Okay, then after we will add, uh, this is actually acid, okay, HCl, hydrochloric acid. So we will add it to acid glass. Okay, and now we will add uh, this dirty water, okay, to the dirty glass. As you can see, make the water dirty. Okay, and this is actually a soda water, okay, and it has low amount of oxygen. Okay, so we will add it into the low DO glass. Okay, you can see. Okay, remember as you can see it is low DO. Okay, so we have mixed up all the things. So as you can see, we have attached the sensor to all the samples. You can see TD sensor, pH sensor, temperature sensor, and this is the DO sensor, and this is the turbidity sensor. Okay, and now let's check it uh, readings on the screen. Okay, uh, pH is 6.7 of okay. so it is our acidic water. Okay, temperature is 24 degrees C, TDC is 21.94. Okay, very high because it, we have added salt to the water okay tablet is 97 percent because the sample is very dirty okay not fresh okay and dissolved oxygen is 13 milligram per liter square okay so it will take some time to show the reading so we are waiting for the new readings okay okay so let's check all the readings on the server so you can see ph is showing here our server on i 6.6 okay 6.6 you can see okay temperature is 24 degrees c so let's check the temperature on the server 
सो यू कैन से टेम्परेचर इज ट्वेंटी फोर डिग्री से ओके टैबलेट नीड टू शेक ओके टैबलेट इज शोइंग हंड्रेड परसेंट बिकॉज वी नीड टू शेक द सैंपल एवरी टाइम यू वॉन्ट टू चेक द प्रॉपर रीडिंग ओके सो इट नीड्स शेकिंग ऑफ द सैंपल ओके अदरवाइज वी विल सी रॉन्ग रीडिंग ओके दैट्स वॉट इज शोइंग हंड्रेड परसेंट अगेन एंड इट इज यू कैन सी ट्वेंटी टू एंड थर्टी वन ओके इट मीन्स इट हैज वेरी हाई अमाउंट ऑफ सॉल्ट ओके सो ना ऑलरेट एड ऑल द सैंपल टी डी सैंपल टू द फ्रेश वाटर अगेन ओके एंड इट इट शूड रिड्यूस द टी डी एस वैल्यू ओके एंड ना वी विल रिमूव दिस जी पी एस सेंसर फ्रॉम एसिडिक वाटर टू लेस फ्रेश वाटर यू कैन सी ओके एंड वी विल रिमूव दिस फ्रॉम हियर ओके एंड ऑल्सो वी विल रिमूव दिट फ्रॉम हियर ओके एंड ऑल्सो वी विल रिमूव ऑल दिस सेंसर ओके टू चेक द न्यू रीडिंग्स ओके सो वी आर वेटिंग फॉर द न्यू रीडिंग So you can see pH new reading has appeared. Okay, C one point two again it is showing because sensor is outside of the sample, or you can consider sample is ah uh, uh, you can say fresh water. Okay, this is a fresh water. So you can see I am adding it. Okay, and uh, the turbidity you can see hundred percent it is showing again. Okay, because sample is inside the uh, outside, or you can you can say in fresh water. Okay, we also have fresh water here. You can see okay, adding it. Okay, and now it will not show any kind of reading because it is it is in fresh water. Okay, okay, dissolved oxygen is zero point. Okay, why? Because it is have attached some amount of okay low uh, oxygen level amount of oxygen levels. Okay, you can see that's what is showing zero percent or seven hundred percent. It is showing okay, and pH is on pH on pH level is seven point four and temperature twenty four degrees C. कि आप सब सम मोमेंट कैन सी न्यू रीडिंग्स आर न्यू रीडिंग्स आर सिक्स हंड्रेड एटी नाइन पी पी एम बिकॉज ऑफ द फ्रेश वाटर सेंसर इज इन साइड द फ्रेश वाटर ओके एंड यू कैन सी डिजोल ऑक्सीजन सेंसर इज सेटल जीरो बिकॉज इट इज आउटसाइड ऑफ द सैम्पल ओके एंड यू कैन सी टी डी एस पी एच इज सेवन पॉइंट फोर बिकॉज इट इज इन फ्रेश वाटर ओके दैट्स वाई फ्रेश वाटर हैव हाई अमाउंट ऑफ पी एच एंड एसिडिक वाटर लो अमाउंट ऑफ पी एच ओके एंड ऑल्सो टैबलेट सेंसर यू कैन सी टैबलेट सेंसर इन साइड द फ्रेश वाटर ओके क्लियर वाटर सो यू कैन सी टैबलेट इज हंड्रेड ऑक्सीजन लेवल टू मिली गाम ऑनली ओके एंड टेम्परेचर ट्वेंटी फोर डिग्री से ऑनली सो ना टाइम टेस्ट टेम्परेचर सेंसर ओके सो वी विल फर्स्ट वी विल पुट द सेंसर पी एस सेंसर टू द फ्रेश वाटर फ्रॉम फ्रेश वाटर टू द एसिडिक वाटर अगेन ओके टू टेक द रीडिंग अगेन ओके सो वी आर रीडिंग इट ओके टू द हाई पी हाई एसिडिक हाई अमाउंट ऑफ एसिडिक वाटर ओके एंड नेट्स रिमूव दिस सेंसर ओके and it should show zero after some 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 time okay because it is outside of the sample and temperature sensor should show high reading okay so we are applying heat to the sensor so you can see and waiting for the new reading so let's see okay remember td should go from uh, 600 to zero and temperature should increase okay and must uh, ph level should decrease okay so as you can see new readings are uh, on the on your screen ph is showing now 619 okay because it is inside the Uh, acidic water okay and temperature uh, will reduce after some time so you can see new temperature reading is 37 degree c and ppm is around 0 okay nearly around 0 it is settling to 0 slowly slowly also we can see lion server okay six ph is okay ph is reducing you can see from uh, 200 to reduce 6.8 okay and uh, we can see temperature is increased you can see the, the graph okay from 23 to of uh, 34 okay And we can see turbidity is uh, same. Uh, TDS is reduced to, so you can see TDS is from, okay, from two thousand to it is reduced from graph to, okay, thirty thirty six only because same sensor is outside of the water. Okay, that's what is showing nearly zero value. Okay, because of some amount of moisture delay, well, it is showing some reading. Okay, let's put it again to the fresh uh, salty water. Okay, and let's remove this to fresh water again. Okay, and let's uh, put this sensor to the uh, low amount of oxygen level. Okay, and we will put uh, this sensor to apply. We will heat. We will apply heat to the sensor to show its uh, performance. Okay, now it should show around more than forty degrees Celsius. Okay, after some moment. So we are waiting for the new readings. Okay, again we are waiting for the new readings. So 
so you can see new readings have appeared of temperatures 40 degrees 43 degrees and it is increased okay as per our expectation and uh, pH level is again increased because of it is in a fresh water now you can see okay and uh, turbidity is 100 percent again as percent and tds is increasing okay from 35 to it is increased to 75 okay and uh, still it is settling okay and more oxygen level is 4 milligram per liter per liter okay so let's see all the parameters on server live okay so uh, ph is increased you can see 7.36 okay you can see the graph from uh, 6 uh, 7 uh, 6.2 7.6 increased okay diesel oxygen level is uh, 66 okay temperature is 42 degrees okay from here to here it is increased okay and here stability is 100 percent and tds level is increased okay you can see graph from 30 43 to it is increased to 1035 okay and again it is increasing slowly slowly okay basically because it takes time a little bit time of two minutes okay and it, it, it is settling to 2000 degrees slowly slowly you can see okay so let's uh, do some uh, other uh, some more testing so let's uh, put uh, this sensor okay to the dirty water okay so we are adding some more dirty water to the sample Okay, and we will check uh, our TD sensor using this sample. Okay, so let's uh, put again some high amount of dirty water, the TD sensor. Okay, and we will check it's in reading. Okay, now it is properly placed, and we are waiting for the new reading for tabulated sensor, and it should reduce. It should reduce from hundred percent to some amount. Okay, as you can see, it is showing now seventy nine percent of. Oh, water clarity you can see turbidity is reduced to from 100 percent to 79 percent let's check this value on live server on iot server so you can see here's the turbidity okay uh, currently it is 60 reduced again to 60 degree uh, sorry 60 ppm uh, sorry 58 percentage okay so you can see on the graph okay from 100 percent it is reduced to 58 percent and again it increased to 100 percent because we need to check the water sample again okay so let's just check it again and waiting for the new reading so you can see new readings again reduced to from 100 percent to 61 percent okay so because uh, this is the problem of tributary sensor we have to again adjust its volume okay so it means it is working fine okay temperatures are also reduced from 40 degree to 30 degree because we are not applying the heat to the sensor okay and pH is again 7.4 because it is in the fresh water okay and this is the acidic water and let's remove the TDS sensor you can see TDS sensor is showing very high amount of ppm TDS value in ppm why because it is inside the salt tube sample let's put it to the fresh water again So waiting for the new uh, TDS value and let's apply some heat to the sensor to see the new temperature readings okay so we will see increased temperature after some moment okay and reduce the TDS value because sensor is in the fresh water okay so you can see new readings are reduced okay from 2000 to 1000 only and temperature is increasing slowly slowly it is showing 29% only now let's uh, again apply some amount of heat to the sensor so you can see new readings are 42 42 degree c and ppm readings are reduced okay it means all the sensor is working so fine okay you can see that uh, tds value okay here in the graph tds is uh, currently 600 ppm okay and remember it is a reading of fresh water okay when fresh water reading comes from 0 to more than 500 and 600 only okay means it is a fresh water so you can see the situation fresh water okay so you can see 542 ppm okay you can see the graph from 2000 to around 2000 to it is coming to 500 only okay because when the reading the reading was 2000 it was in the salty water okay so it means our project is working so fine thank you so much for watching the video if any is want to have any any kind of query please uh, do comment in the in the video and we will guide you Okay, after watching the entire demo session now let's just see back side of the system okay so here you can see 
and let's see the back side of wiring of the system so i am putting it in this way okay this is the temperature sensor this is the turbidity sensor back side this is the dissolved oxygen back side sensor okay, tds sensor back side this is the uh, voltage reducer and this is the ps sensor back side lcd back side okay this one and this is the main board and this is the 5 volt uh, as you can see 3.3 volt junction this is the lcd console this is the main switch and this is the uh, 9 volt input okay you can see and these are the stands okay thank you so much